y'all, Shay here. Uh, today we have an unboxing, and as you can see, it's from Diamond Art Club, Do What Makes You Sparkle. And I was on vacation last week, so I've had this for about a week, so I really wanted to get this out so y'all could see it. Um, it is still available on their website, and I am filming this on Monday, May 30th, Memorial Day, and they're actually having a Memorial Day sale, 20% uh, off if you put in the code Memorial20. So yeah, definitely go check this out if you like it. All right, so you can see it's a square, okay, square, square diamonds. And not only is it square diamonds, it's a square painting in the size of the entire painting. And I love that size, okay? I love a full square. It is a long journey home and it's licensed artwork by Simona Candini. And it's a 22 by 22 in inches or 56 by 56 in centimeters. It does have 48 colors and three ABs. And AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And it's a special coating they put on those three drills just to make them sparkle just a little bit brighter than the others. So yes, let's get into this, y'all. I'm so excited. Um, I am a huge, absolute fanatic about The Wizard of Oz. So when I saw this, I had to get it. Um, I do love Simona Candini. I've done one of her other paintings uh, called Honey Mermaid. And it was a mermaid with uh, some bees and like honey was dripping down. Really, really great painting and I really enjoyed it. Uh, Diamond Art Club does include a logbook sticker. Or, so you can put this in a logbook or you can put it on the side of your box. It's got all the information you need so you know what painting it is. And let's see, what else do we have in here? Here is the toolkit. Ooh, it's a new toolkit, awesome. Uh, you may not get this particular toolkit. Diamond Art Club is phasing out some of their older toolkits and putting some of these newer ones in. So you never know what you're gonna get. They're both great. These have just a couple of extra things in them, some washi tape and a cover minder. Is that it? Yep, that's all that's in the box. And make sure you scan, never pay, never pay full price. Always use a code. There's a code on your packing slip, codes on the box, codes on the painting, they're everywhere. All right, so let's put that over there. Let's go ahead and take a look at the toolkit. Now you necessarily do not need to rip it right here like you think you would, because you see the little notch. It just opens up from the top. So if you wanna save the bag, go ahead and open it that way. All right, let's get into this. Ooh, good stuff here, y'all. Okay, so. Now the pen that they give you always matches the little squishy. So this is a little comfort squish. It just slides on here and it's got a green glittery pen. Can you all see that? So this just makes it just a little more comfortable as you're diamond painting. It's a little grip. And then there are two multi-placers. There's a four and a seven, and these are the thin ones. And what you do with these are you just put this on the back of your pen and these will help you place more than one diamond at a time so you can grab seven. It does take practice. Um, it took me about a year until I started using the multi-placers. It's good to start with the four and then just kind of move up from there if you choose to multi-place, but single placing is just as satisfying. All right, let's see what else we get. You do get tweezers uh, in your square kits. So that's why we've got a pair. It does have a cover on it. These are very, very sharp. So be careful with these, but they pick up drills great. Um, these are really good if you have a hair on your diamond painting piece of food. If you realize a drill is maybe in the wrong spot, I use the tweezers all the time. Some people even place drills with tweezers instead of a pen. So it's amazing. But yeah, the tweezers really come in handy. You do get some reusable baggies. Okay, so if you have any leftover drills when you're finished, you can store them in here. Here's your wax, and it does come in a little heart wax caddy. So it keeps it nice and fresh. There are two plates of wax in here. And be sure to remember whenever you start, there are plastic covers on the top and bottom of this. I've done it many times, tried to put my pen in here and it doesn't pick it up. So you just have to slide off this plastic, okay? Yes, and their pink wax is great. I love this little caddy. Ooh, look at this, y'all. This is a cover minder. And what it does is it's got two magnets and this just holds back your plastic because there is a plastic over the glue. This holds back your plastic, and that way you can get to your painting and your plastic won't get in the way. You just put one magnet underneath and you put one on top and they meet each other. Ooh, I like this washi tape. 
It's like very geometric. I like this. So washi tape can be used for a couple of different things. Um, aesthetically, it's nice to use um, to kind of put around the border of your painting because there is a little bit of the glue that goes over the edge. So you won't get any sticky, your sweater, anything in it. And then also to section off your diamond painting. You can put rows and columns of washi tape. So you kind of just know what section you're working on and try to focus on one area. So this is a big roll of washi tape. Awesome. And of course, last but not least, the tray. And it is a clear tray and it's got some gold glitter in it. Very nice tray. And then here's a stopper. So when you shake your drills, they don't come out. And I'm still trying to figure out which way it goes. There we go. Yeah, so there's a little stopper included. So that's everything you need. Thank you, Diamond Art Club. And of course, that shows everything you have here and what comes in here. All right, so let's just scooch all this aside and let's get to the main event. So again, has a dust bag. Keep it protected. Oh, I'm so excited about this. I actually have three diamond paintings that came in when I was gone for the week. And this is, I'm doing them in order of when they when I received them. This is the first one that came in. So I wanted to get this to y'all, especially with the sale that they're having. I wanted you to be able to see this. Oh, their canvases are so soft. They do have the scalloped edges, so it won't fray. Okay, very, very nice. I've never had any issues with Diamond Art Club. Yeah, it's top-notch quality. All right, y'all ready? Let's do the drill reveal. Let's look at these beautiful colors. Oh, there's some other stuff trying to come out. We're doing the drill reveal right now. Hold on, let me hold it back. Let's look at these colors. Look at the palette, there we go. Oh, I see some ABs. I see a lime green AB. I see a blue AB. You can see it right there. See that extra sparkle right there and there. And we'll look at those in just a second. Oh, I love these colors. And there's the red AB. Gotta have the red AB. Whoops, sorry y'all, I didn't mean to shake you. Awesome. Love these colors. So Diamond Art Club does put the name of the painting on the bag. And whenever you're kidding up and you wanna use a storage container for your drills, um, I always keep this big plastic bag to put all my trash in, to put these bags back in. And then you just seal it up and throw it away. Or if you store your drills separate, then you'll know which painting they go to. Cause some people do that. They'll store this somewhere, they'll hang these up and they'll store these in a box. All right, so we'll look at the drills in just a second. Let's take a look at this canvas. All right, Diamond Art Club does have poured glue. So with poured glue, you can roll it backwards. Now they already have self-flattening canvases, but for the sake of filming, and I wanna get it as flat as possible so we can see where the ABs go, I'm just gonna roll it back on itself. Oh, it's such a great size. Love the size. And we'll have to go through the other goodies that were in there. Oh, it's so soft, y'all. I can already tell it's already flattening. You know what? I don't think I'm gonna need to roll it backwards. It's in great condition. Let's just, let's just flip it over. But before I do that, let's take a little peek at these goodies before we get ahead of ourselves. So this is a little brochure they put in there. Thank you for your purchase. And they do have a Diamond Art Club app for your iPhone or Android. So go ahead and scan those and download the app. It's a great way to look at the paintings. It does show you everything that comes inside. They also have a video that they've made. So you can scan this and watch the video. And here's step-by-step -step instructions. So everything you need. Here's tips and tricks. Yes. All right. And then here is the love the sticker. This is this whole entire sheet is a sticker. So depending on what you use and how you log things and what you want to use it for, a lot of times I will just cut like cut off the diamond art club. Part. Sorry, diamond art club. I'll cut this part off and just save this information in my logbook and put the other sticker on the side of the box. But look at this image. She's reading a book. Look at her hair. Yeah, I've been Dorothy so many times. And then you've got the little dolls in here. You've got the Tin Man doll, and you've got the little scarecrow, and you've got looks like looks like some you know prisms from like Emerald City over here as well. That would be really fun to put some ABs in. I bet that's where some of those lime greens are gonna go. Okay, let's see. Oh, best part of all, I forgot to talk about. These are peel and stick labels. They're individually cut. Back in the day, that wasn't the case. You had to cut them all individually. So now, okay, so we have, oh, you know what? That's interesting. It said 48 colors on the, on the website. That's because there's three ABs. So it's actually 51 colors, okay? And that includes 115, 135, and 140. So anything under 150 with Diamond Art Club is considered an AB. So you can tell the next one is 165 and that's not an AB. But yes, they've got 115, 135, and 140. I like how they have everything just coded. Great symbols. Okay, y'all ready? 
Yeah, I'm not gonna need to roll it backwards. You can if you need to. But, oh my gosh, look at this. Look at her. I love her blue dress and the little blue ribbons in her hair. She's got beautiful green eyes. I bet those AVs are gonna go in her eyes. Oh, wow. Y'all, like I said, I've been Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz. I don't know how many Halloweens. I was her last Halloween. Uh, my daughter's been her. Um, what I would really like to do is for like my 50th birthday, which is in a few years, um, I would like to have a Wizard of Oz themed birthday party for my 50th. I thought that would be really, really fun. So I had to get this. There was just no question. Plus, I love a 56 by 56. I mean, you can see it's just a perfect square. Love it. All right. So let's go ahead and look at the drills. Let's see what we've got. So I will, um, sorry about the crinkle. And like I said, hold on to this bag because it makes for a great trash bag. I just prop it open like this and it just stays open and I just throw all my trash in there and seal it up and throw it away. It's really nice when you're kidding up. Now we use the word kidding up when we're talking about moving everything from baggies to storage containers or kidding down when you're finished with a painting and you wanna you know, empty out the containers and store your, your leftover drills. Oh, this is beautiful. All right, let's take a look. I've got one bag here that's by itself. This is 3815. Oh, their drills are something. These are resin drills. Look at the sparkle and the flat bottoms on these. We've got a little bit of, just a little tiny piece of trash, not a big deal, but I love this green. There's gonna be a lot of greens, right? Oh yeah, there's gonna be a lot of greens. Look at all these greens. All right, so let's go through the trains and then we'll point out the ABs, okay? All right, let's get going. Whoops, backwards. All right, we've got 936. We've got one, two, two bags of 936. We've got 580, one, two, two bags of that. We've got 935, two bags of 935. They definitely like the two bags here of everything. Uh, we've got one bag of 434, 436, 500, yeah, these are all different shades. Oh, two bags of 500. It's like a really, really deep, almost like a um, like an army green. It's really, really deep green. You'll see that, it's really pretty. Uh, two bags of 581, we've got five, th well, sorry, 437, 3861, 165, and 744. All right, so that's one set of drills. I'm back. I had to pause real quick. Let's go ahead and go through the next chain or train. I don't know how you want to say it. All right. We have got 561. These drills look so good. 834, 433, 733, 3023. We've got two bags of 435. We've got 898. Really dark brown color. We've got 453. Oh, y'all. 135. Look at that neon green. That lime green AB. So this is what an AB looks like. See this, this extra coating that's on there that makes it sparkle? So let's go ahead and grab this one. And we're going to take a look and see where this one goes after we go through all the drills. All right. Oh, oh, I gotta be careful with that one. Okay, we've got 37.55. Here's our other AB, 140. All right. I should have brought my scissors over here, y'all. I'm gonna have to use some tape on this one. All right, so we've got 135. We've got 140. Let's see what else we've got. We've got 30.33. 647, 739, 758, 912. Oh, I like that green color. 646, 3778, and 3841. All right, and I see our red AB coming up, y'all. All right, we've got 648, 334, 754. That might be skin color, it looks like. 645, 813. 3822, 
a little mauve color. Oh, look at that yellow, 444. I like that. 844, 988, 3830, 3371, 814, 498, and last but not least, that ruby red, 115. Awesome. All right, let's take a look at the canvas. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the canvas. We did not look at the drill field. I always like to look at their faces. So let's bring up her face and see the clarity. Yes, very, very nice. Diamond Art Club, again, y'all, is just top notch. The drill field is just crystal clear. It's perfect. All right, so her face looks good. Of course, let's check the sticky. Yep, very sticky. They do have a legend on the top left and on the bottom right. And then of course at the bottom has got the thumbnail with all the information, okay? It's got their socials down here, another discount code, and then their lifetime warranty. All right, let's go ahead and see where the ABs go. And I apologize for the glare. It's kind of that time of night. All right, let's start off with 115. That's this red, not a huge bag, but nice size. Um, the only place I see it, it's number one, and I see it in her lips right there. You see that? Just a few in her lips. Again, I really wish she had the ruby red slippers, but that's okay. Uh, the next one is 135, and it's that lime green. That's going to be, that's number two. So I do see it over here in the trees. Um, I definitely see it um, in her eyes. Okay, so it's going to be the center of her eyes. I do see a couple of twos in there. And it's also in these crystals right here. I see some right here. And then there is some um, up here in the trees, a lighter green. So it's gonna be accenting the green. There's also some down here. Yeah, so it's just kind of sprinkled throughout where the green is. And then the last one is this really pretty blue. That's 140 and that's three. And that's gonna be in her dress. That will be outlining her bows in her hair, the ribbon outlining this one. And then it's all this blue that you see outlining her dress, okay? And also down here and down here in the pleats of her dress. So not a lot of ABs, but enough. And again, you can definitely enhance it more. But again, I love the Wizard of Oz. I love Simona Candini and of course, Diamond Art Club. So it just was a home run for me. And I think it's adorable. I love the little dog in the basket. That's supposed to be Toto, but it doesn't really, it kind of looks like Toto, but super cute, y'all. Um, yeah, so again, this is available right now as of Monday, May 30th, and they are having a sale. So I would grab this if you're interested and you can get 20% off if you use Memorial 20, all right? Okay, y'all, uh, that's gonna be it for this one. If you enjoyed this, please give me a thumbs up. It does help. And if you have not subscribed yet, there's a subscribe button down below and it is free. It just lets me know that you like what I'm doing and I'm on the right track. And if you do and you wanna see more, go ahead and hit that notification bell right next to the subscribe button and you'll be notified every time I post up any new videos. All right, this is a long journey home and it's the Wizard of Oz. Okay, y'all take care. Uh, I love you and I'll see you in the next one. Okay, bye guys.